All right, we are going to the movies to see the bad guys. You ready, little man? Yeah! All right, it was super windy when we walked out of the movies, so we're doing this here. What'd you think of the movie? It was awesome! What'd you think, babe? It was cute. I thought it was pretty solid. The Bad Guys is directed by Perry Parathel and stars Sam Rockwell, Mark Marin, Aquafina, Craig Robinson, Anthony Ramos, and Richard Aoade. Man, I'm bad at pronouncing names. A lot of familiar faces behind the voices here. And honestly, when I was watching the movie, I didn't realize that Sam Rockwell was voicing the main character. And to me, that's the magic of animated film. I feel like that's good voice acting because they're basically becoming that character and you can't even recognize their voice anymore. Or at least it's different enough from their normal voice in other films it sounds unique to that movie but if you ask me the bad guys was a much better film than i was expecting dreamworks animation can be hit or miss but i felt like the dialogue between the characters in this movie was pretty solid for an animated film i totally believed the character motivations because it's so dialogue heavy some of the movie does feel like it drags a little bit and it could be a little bit shorter because i feel like the average kid has a hard time sitting for longer than 90 minutes it was towards the very end of the film that theo started to get a little stir crazy but until that point in the movie, he was very engaged, and so was I. And I also really liked the animation style on this one. The elements that they mixed together made the action sequences look very unique, or at least different enough to stand out to me amongst other animated films. And the movie has a solid message, what makes you a good person or a bad person, and it also deals with friendship and things like that. But when I go see a family film, what I'm hoping I'll get is a movie that is fun for the whole family. And I feel like that's what we got. I think my favorite character was probably Craig Robinson voicing the shark. I love Craig Robinson and his style of humor. And another thing I should note is that each one of these characters in the gang does get their spotlight. Their characters are all fleshed out enough that I did care for each one of them. And when you care about the characters, the jokes tend to land more. The movie's also set in LA, which is cool. I can't remember the last time I've seen an animated LA, but the style of lighting that they used for the animation made it look really cool, especially with like the city in the background and stuff. Very LA looking. But this is basically taking the LA heist concept and putting it into family form. Again, the plot is nothing crazy. There is some good little twists and turns, but we're basically following these characters that are led by Wolf as he struggles with the idea of becoming good because being good feels good. But being that this group of friends are so used to being the bad guys, Wolf and these other characters have to deal with their internal struggle between doing what they're used to and what they're good at and changing for the better. And I mean, the movie doesn't get crazy deep or anything, but I feel like it definitely takes the dialogue more seriously than other anime films but overall my family had a fun time the movie kept us all engaged for the vast majority of the film and I think it's definitely worth the watch and I am gonna give the bad guys a 7.5 out of 10. It's a great one to take the family to, and it's a legitimately funny little movie. And I'm actually curious to see how it does at the box office, because we are less than two weeks out from Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. I'm very excited about that one. I've got tickets for opening night, but I do have some more movie reviews coming, so stay tuned for those. And guys, if you like these videos, you want to see more of them, be sure to drop a like, subscribe, and also turn on notifications so you don't miss a single one. And also, be sure to use GPL code DannyD. That'll save you 10 to 30% off some tasty caffeinated beverages. And also, just because I love you guys, I want to let you know that there is a giveaway for this tub of generic marshmallow birds. It's the new Easter-inspired G Fuel flavor. It's completely free. And for more details on that giveaway, be sure to go check out my review on this flavor that I just dropped yesterday. I will be picking the winner tomorrow. So if you're some of the awesome people who are watching this video in the first 24 hours, you still have a chance to enter for this tub. And if you guys made it to the end of this video, be sure to comment the word bad because that lets me know that you watch the whole thing and you're a real one as always stay safe be nice to each other out there and i'll see you in the next one peace